Ooh, welcome to this scorn let's play this new indie game which looks already way too effed up for my liking as you can see i don't need to explain what's going on i feel like it's gonna be a horror like game survival what i've heard also a little bit of shooter elements but most so it's about the effed up aesthetics as you can see and it's yeah it's a horror game i'm playing it on the middle of the day don't really have a choice gotta be quick with new games and bring out content we got 28 gigabyte of download space for this game also 28 gigabytes you need to download 40 euros or 35 euros it costed sadly just one volume slider which is gonna be weird there you have some video resolution options and I can play with controller, those are the most important things. I'm planning a full let's play. Let's see how jump scared I'm gonna get. And I'm planning on shooting out 8 parts immediately of this game. But let's jump into it and see how the loudness is gonna treat us. Since there's no mixing for me, don't open your eyes. Don't do it. He's gonna open his eyes. Yeah, good thing I'm playing this in the middle of the day and not before going to sleep. Lovely. Oops. <laughs> I wanted to turn the face cam on off for the cutscenes, then I realized. can't play this game borderless so that means that I'm getting audio glitches every time I windows out and that's not a cool thing and as soon as there is voice acting I will shut up I'm already getting jump scared Okay, that's how I landed here. Lovely. The art style is pretty cool and the visual, the graphics are pretty high and good looking. My PC is not overheating, that's weird. With the other indie game I played or tried two days ago, Time Maltos, my PC constantly overheats. Even though this looks already more graphically in impressive and detailed. From what I've seen, this game also started from Kickstarter. I had a Kickstarter campaign. I'm gonna try something really quick here. I have scaling all the way up. Normally this makes things more gritty and detailed. That's not my controller. Not at all. I'm gonna aim parts for like at the 20 minute mark. Mm. Don't run. It doesn't look that smooth. Ah, I like scaling. Even my face cam is scaled a little bit. I can show you. <sighs> Another time, or at the end of the episode. I'm just j running through here. That has an amazing atmosphere already. It looks, looks more like a movie so far. And I don't feel like it's running that smooth. But it looks amazing. And feels very cool and atmospheric. That's how the new old Dead Space remaster should feel like and look like. Which is also something... I'm gonna play January, Dead Space, Remaster, and probably 1 and 2 also on my channel with mods. Can I even go in there? Probably not, right? No, Invisible Wall. But you can see how detailed everything is. Even the light. That's... 
hunt crafted. Uh, things hunt crafted here. And that's why video games are art, ladies and gentlemen. Okay. Let me guess, can't go in. I uh, can't press anything. Okay. Ooh. Yeah, we're looking badass, don't we? I don't know how much of a horror game or actual survival game this is going to be like. But I'm already impressed by how it looks. Audio so far ain't a problem either. Maybe they have just mixed it very well so that I don't need to take extra steps. And maybe there's just no voice acting which makes things easier for them. I don't even know what button I pressed. We have lovely hands. I'm getting easily jump scared. That's a toilet. It could be a comfortable toilet. As long as there are no snakes and face huggers. I should be good. But like I said, I'm getting easily jump scared. Okay, let's press that first. There's no button prompt here. Is it circle? Six. It's six. Yeah, definitely. Why would you do that? Oh, you got actually something good for you. And you're bleeding. Ah! We are assassin now. <laughs> Any buttons I can press for that? No. Nope. Ladies and gentlemen, that's how you become an assassin. Oh, fan. Ah, I can stick my hand in there too. Mm. Now all we need is some infinity stones. Don't give me too many puzzles. <laughs> um, yeah, let's just go through. Why not? cool looking if there are actually no jump scares I don't really need the face cam because it just takes away from the visual stunningness of the game I haven't even checked if I could play that in German probably um, I'm always pressing circle yeah, no, I wouldn't touch that. I hate it. It's passes all over again. Let's just connect everything. Make a big circle. We got a circle here. That's all we can do. Maybe that's all we need. It's already too many puzzles. Already too many puzzles, I hate it. That's the only thing I don't want, puzzles. Uh. 
Okay. And we... <laughs> oh no. Ah, oh, why game? Why already puzzles? Oh, I've got everything in the circle, which is probably not needed. Is that the way I came from? Oh god. Damn you. God damn you game. Already making me think. Ah. Oh. There was a, actually no difficulty slider. There's just puzzles. And I hate puzzles. Just wanna shoot stuff. Okay. I can do that like that. Da like that, and da like that, and everything is, yeah, sure, I tried it the other way beforehand, let's try it like this. Okay, are you doing something now? Maybe I can push something down this line. Oh boy. Ah. Nobody said this is gonna be a puzzle game. God damn it. Don't stick your dick in that. Pretty much everything that is here. Considered it. I need something here, don't I? And what I really need is a shotgun. Okay. Even enter. Oh. Why? Why though? I mean, what? Oh, there's too many patterns. Too much to figure out. Game says no. What? And I expected a shooter. Shame on me. Let's try this again. There needs to be something in the middle of here, right? 
and jump in there. Um. I hate bustles. Hate them. Don't stick your head in there. I mean, we're sticking a hand in everything. And I don't know why. More toilets. I would jump in there. Immediately. Ah, oh, what is this torture? Let's just press this first and then the other one. I mean, it's not gonna do anything. There's nothing here. Oh boy. Just give me a shotgun, please. And don't let me think. The hell? Can I carry anything? Can I pick something up here? No? Oh god. Is this just just a showcase of the map? Does this bring me anywhere? Oh boy. More to explore. More puzzles to explore. I don't have a clue what's going on. Just give me a shotgun. I'm already lost. Ah, oh, please do something. Drop a ball or something. Let me play soccer. You bastard. Every time. Just nothing happens. Can I jump? No. Nope. Look at me lovely six pack. That looks very healthy. Good job dude. You've been working out. Getting into the best shape possible. For me to have no clue what to do. Pick anything up like that, even though that would seem like the solution. Well, well, well. Seems like this game will have me wondering what to do. And I played a puzzle game on my channel, Farm Murders, just recently. A lot of puzzles. Feel like I, in the end, did not do that badly. Yeah. Maybe I wasn't supposed to go through the door. Maybe I've screwed myself from the beginning. Okay. That's not the way I came from. I feel like those things seem like the solution. It can't be that this is just aimlessly wandering around, right? Come on, mind. Okay, okay. Run, move, weapon. Nope. Wrote that dog inventory load switch. No weapons so far. Merp, 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 merp. Yeah, I guess this is part one. I'm gonna run around a little bit and see if I figure stuff out. Peace out.